I was inspired to do this post today because I keep hearing the question from a lot of business owners and that question is legitimate. Is SEO dead? It's a legit question since SEO has lost a lot of popularity over the years. Obviously there's been a lot of newer marketing platforms out there but before we look at the data I want to first ask all of you watching this right now to like and share this with your friends, your fellow entrepreneurs, and if you haven't already, follow us and enable push notifications so that way you can stay up to date on important topics that we can share with you and help you grow your business. Now that we have that out of the way, let's get down to it. The big question, is SEO dead? And right now there's roughly about five and a half billion searches online through Google. That's roughly two trillion searches a year. Now, although that's a lot of searches, there's also a lot of content being created. There's roughly a billion blogs on the web. For example, if you look at the long tail phrase, what is digital marketing? There's only 11,300 global searches a month, but a whopping 665,000 pieces of content trying to answer that one question. So in other words, the supply is much greater than the demand. And you'll see even more of this for other phrases like, let's say banana, for example. There's 640,000 searches which seems like a lot, but there's over 800 million content pieces listed. And bear in mind, obviously all that content isn't about the food banana. The idea is that search volume is going up. So where there's a lot of search volume, there's obviously a lot of content. That trend is continually increasing, which obviously content is increasing the demand. But on top of that, Google is turning into an answer engine, which they're answering people's questions without them having to do anything other than go to Google. So the trend is so common, in fact, that the percentage of traffic we've noticed over the years on Google organic listings has been decreasing over time. So the question is, does this mean SEO is dead? It's actually the opposite. SEO is well and alive. Now, I know that some of you are probably asking with all the data, Robert, how can that be the case? How is SEO well and alive? First off, all marketing channels become saturated over time. Is this a question of when? So to give you an example, think about Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, even email marketing. Heck, just look at the image below here I'm listing. It was the first banner ad on the internet. Now, I want you all to guess what company created that banner ad. It was AT&T. And of the people who saw it at the time, 44% of them clicked on it. Now, banner ads generate currently an average of a half of a percent click-through rate. That's a huge drop. And as I mentioned, it's with all the channels. Just look at Instagram engagement rates. It doesn't matter if it's a sponsored post nowadays or an organic post. The trend on Instagram is that engagement is going down. And that's why you're seeing a lot of people like Gary Vee or Grant Cardone promoting their phone number all over Instagram. Why is that? So they can communicate with their fans directly without having to deal with the algorithms or the platforms decreasing their engagement. But even with those decreasing numbers, you're seeing a sponsored post on Instagram surging. In fact, it's surging by 150%. So in other words, people are still spending money because they're seeing ROI or generating enough value in their eyes. So the question is, how is SEO still not dead? And as I explained, just because the metrics aren't going in your favor doesn't mean that the channel is dead. It means you're doing it wrong. And if you're a business owner right now that's struggling with your Google ranking and you're frustrated, and I know there are a lot of agencies out there that will offer you low price SEO and offer you the minimum work and results. And naturally, like most people, if you've had a bad experience, you don't want to experience that same feeling again. So I get it. But the answer is not ignoring your Google ranking and pretending that SEO isn't a factor for your business. So if you're tired of wasting money on bad SEO or haven't even started doing SEO, tap on the link in our description box or profile and request a free demo. It's that simple. You'll talk to a human being that really cares about your success. And uh, that's it for now. I'm gonna enjoy the beach. Hope to see you soon.